A police car in flames. Another day of violence as protesters clash with police in Egypt's capital. The protests, which were nationwide, were calling for the release of students from prison and for ousted Muslim Brotherhood President Mohamed Morsi to be returned to office. Demonstrators raised a four-finger symbol and chanted anti-government slogans. Friday is the third day in an 11-day campaign launched by the National Alliance for the Support of Legitimacy, a coalition of groups with ties to the Muslim Brotherhood movement. They believe the country is in the grip of a military coup. On top of their list of demands, justice for the protesters killed last year by security forces, a return to what the group calls constitutional legitimacy, and for a democratic Egypt, something they believe the army have blocked. The military-backed government has dissolved the Muslim Brotherhood movement and declared it a terrorist organization. It has been a week of protests not only in Cairo and Alexandria, but also in the far-flung cities of Kafr sheikh in the north and Asyut in the south. The government has responded with more security on the streets. So far, several protesters have been killed or wounded. The police are braced for more unrest as the demonstrations continue. Mohamed Val, Al Jazeera.